Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. A teacher is giving a lecture in a classroom. B. Passengers are boarding a flight. C. A group of people is entering a cafe. D. A woman is speaking on the phone at a train station. The correct answer is D. A woman is speaking on the phone at a train station. Number 2. A. People are waiting in line to order food. B. A waiter is assisting a customer with her laptop. C. A woman is reading a book at a restaurant. D. A waiter is serving drinks to a group of people. The correct answer is B. A waiter is assisting a customer with her laptop. Number 3. A. A barista is making coffee at a cafe. B. A chef is preparing food in the kitchen. C. A man is looking at his phone behind a coffee counter. D. A woman is buying groceries at a supermarket. The correct answer is C. A man is looking at his phone behind a coffee counter. Number 4. A. A group of students is taking a test. B. People are studying in a library. C. A teacher is explaining a concept to students. D. A waiter is serving drinks in a classroom. The correct answer is D. A waiter is serving drinks in a classroom. Number 5. A. Workers are discussing plans on a construction site. B. Two people are running a race. C. A woman is sitting at a desk. D. A group of people is having dinner at a restaurant. The correct answer is A. Typing on a computer. Number 6. A. A woman is giving a presentation in an auditorium. B. A group of students is walking down the hallway. C. A teacher is handing out books to students. D. A man is writing mathematical equations on a blackboard. The correct answer is D. A man is writing mathematical equations on a blackboard. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. What time is the CEO's speech? I so so on the CEO's speech. A. At 3 p.m. B. He is from Japan. C. No, I missed it. The correct answer is A. At 3 p.m. Number 2. Who will attend the training session? A. All staff members. B. Yes, I'll be there too. C. It's on Thursday. The correct answer is A. All staff members. Number 3. Can you finish the report by tomorrow? A. I'll try my best. B. No, I haven't finished reading yet. C. It's a good report. The correct answer is A. I'll try my best. Number 4. Where did you put the report? A. On your desk. B. I'll do it later. C. Yesterday afternoon. The correct answer is A. On your desk. Number 5. Who's responsible for the project proposal? A. I'll send it to everyone. B. Not until next week. C. John is taking care of that. The correct answer is C. John is taking care of that. 
Number 6. Do you know where the post office is? A. The stamp collection is impressive. B. I mailed the package yesterday. C. It's next to the library. The correct answer is C. It's next to the library. Number 7. Are you coming to the company dinner? A. Yes, I already RSVP'd. B. No, I have another appointment. C. The dinner will be on Friday. The correct answer is A. Yes, I already RSVP'd. Number 8. Where did you buy this book? A. I started reading it yesterday. B. I love reading books. C. At the bookstore downtown. The correct answer is C. At the bookstore downtown. Number 9. Do you know where my keys are? A. Check your bag. B. They are on the kitchen table. C. I haven't seen them. The correct answer is B. They are on the kitchen table. Number 10. Can you come to the conference call? A. Yes, I can join the call. B. I have another meeting. C. The call is at 2 p.m. The correct answer is A. Yes, I can join the call. Number 11. Where did you buy that jacket? A. It's comfortable. B. At the new mall. C. I like it, too. The correct answer is B. At the new mall. Number 12. How do you get to the main office? A. Take the bus line number 5. B. I like the main office. C. It's already 5 o'clock. The correct answer is A. Take the bus line number 5. Great job so far. Next is part 3. Listening, conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number 1. We're planning a team outing this weekend. Any suggestions on where to go? How about hiking in the mountains? That sounds great. I'll send out a poll for everyone to vote. What will the man do next? A. Cancel the outing. B. Schedule the outing. C. Send a poll. The correct answer is C. Send a poll. Number 2. I need to book a flight to New York for the conference. Do you have any preferences on airlines or times? As long as it's a direct flight and leaves in the morning, I'm good. I'll look into it and send you the options shortly. What does the man prefer for his flight? A. An evening flight. B. A direct morning flight. C. A flight with layovers. The correct answer is B. A direct morning flight. Number 3. I need to confirm the details of our dinner reservation. Sure, what do you need? Can you check if it's for 7 p.m.? I'll call the restaurant and confirm. What time is the dinner reservation? A. 7 p.m. B. 6 p.m. C. 8 p.m. The correct answer is A. 7 p.m. Number 4. Are you free to discuss the budget proposal this week? I am, but only on Thursday or Friday. How about, uh, um, uh, so how about Friday afternoon? That works for me. When will they discuss the budget proposal? A. On Friday afternoon. B. On Thursday morning. C. On Wednesday afternoon. The correct answer is A. On Friday afternoon. Number 5. Do you have time to review the budget proposal? I can look at it after lunch. That would be great. I need your approval by 3 p.m. I'll make sure to get it done before then. When will the man review the budget proposal? A. After lunch. B. Before lunch. C. At 3 p.m.
The correct answer is A. After lunch. Number six. I need to take a day off next Monday. That should be fine. Do you have any urgent tasks that need to be covered? Just one client call in the afternoon. I'll handle it for you. Who will handle the client call? A. The woman. B. Another colleague. C. The man. The correct answer is A. The woman. Number seven. I'm thinking of taking Thursday off for a personal appointment. That's fine. Just make sure to update the team calendar. Will do. I'll also finish my tasks beforehand. Excellent. Enjoy your day off. Why is the woman taking Thursday off? A. For vacation. B. For a business trip. C. For a personal appointment. The correct answer is C. For a personal appointment. Number 8. Can I schedule my annual leave for the last week of August? I'll need to check the team calendar first. Please let me know as soon as possible. I'll do that by the end of today. When does the woman want to take leave? A. Middle of August. B. Last week of August. C. First week of September. The correct answer is B. Last week of August. Number 9. Can you attend the training session on Wednesday? I have another commitment that day. Any chance we can reschedule? I'll check with the trainer and get back to you. What does the woman need to do? A. Reschedule her commitment. B. Attend the session. C. Check with the trainer. The correct answer is C. Check with the trainer. Number 10. Can you finalize the report by Friday? I should be able to, but I need the data from John first. I'll remind him to send it to you by the end of today. Great. That will help a lot. What is the woman waiting for to finalize the report? A. Feedback from a client. B. Approval from the manager. C. Data from John. The correct answer is C. Data from John. Number 11. Hello. I would like to schedule a dental appointment. Of course. Are you available next Monday afternoon? Yes, that works for me. Perfect. We'll see you at 2 p.m. When is the dental appointment? A. Next Monday afternoon. B. Tomorrow afternoon. C. Next Monday morning. The correct answer is A. Next Monday afternoon. Number 12. How was your flight to New York? It was delayed by two hours. Sorry to hear that. Were you able to get some work done? Yes, I reviewed some reports. Why was the man's flight delayed? A. Due to weather. B. It was cancelled. C. Due to technical issues. The correct answer is A. Due to weather. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Our community center will be offering free yoga classes every Tuesday and Thursday at 6 p.m. for the next three months. All levels are welcome. Please bring your own mat and a water bottle. When are the yoga classes being held? A. Tuesdays and Thursdays. B. Weekends only. C. Mondays and Fridays. The correct answer is B. Tuesdays and Thursdays. Number 2. Welcome to the Tech Innovators Conference. Today's focus is on the latest advancements in artificial intelligence. Don't miss the keynote speech by Dr. Jane Smith at 10 a.m. We have numerous breakout sessions planned throughout the day. Enjoy exploring the future of technology. Who will give the keynote speech? A. Dr. Jane Smith. B. Dr. Alex Brown. C. Dr. John Doe. The 
The correct answer is A. Dr. Jane Smith. Number three. Good afternoon. This is your captain speaking. We are cruising at an altitude of 35,000 feet. Weather is clear for a smooth flight. We'll begin our descent in about 30 minutes. What is the current altitude of the flight? A. 40,000 feet. B. 20,000 feet. C. 35,000 feet. The correct answer is C. 35,000 feet. Number 4. Attention shoppers. There is a clearance sale on all winter clothing items. Visit the store in the main shopping center to grab the best deals. This sale will only last until the end of this week. Until when will the clearance sale last? A. Until the end of the month. B. Until tomorrow. C. Until the end of this week. The correct answer is B. Until the end of this week. Number 5. Attention shoppers, our annual sale starts today and will continue through the weekend. Enjoy discounts up to 50% on selected items. Don't miss out on these great bargains at our store. When does the annual sale end? A. Tomorrow. B. Today. C. This weekend. The correct answer is C. This weekend. Number 6. Our company is launching a new product next month. It's designed to help small businesses manage their finances more effectively. Be sure to visit our website for more information. We will also host webinars to introduce its features. When will the new product be launched? A. Next week. B. Next year. C. Next month. The correct answer is B. Next month. Number 7. Our fitness center is offering a limited time discount on memberships. New members who sign up this month will receive a 20% discount on our annual membership fee. The facility includes state-of-the-art equipment, free fitness classes, and personal training sessions. Don't miss this opportunity to improve your health and well-being at a reduced cost. What discount is being offered? A. 20% off. B. 10% off. C. 30% off. The correct answer is C. 20% off. Number 8. Attention all passengers. The train to New York will be delayed by 30 minutes due to track maintenance. We apologize for the inconvenience and appreciate your patience. Please listen for further announcements for updated schedules. Why is the train to New York delayed? A. Technical issues. B. Track maintenance. C. Weather conditions. The correct answer is A. Track maintenance. Number 9. Attention, all employees, the fire drill will take place tomorrow at 10 a.m. Please ensure you know your evacuation routes. Report to the designated assembly point once you exit the building. Safety wardens will be on hand to assist. What time is the fire drill? A. 11 a.m. B. 10 a.m. C. 9 a.m. The correct answer is C. 10 a.m. Number 10. Welcome to our annual Community Health Fair. We have a wide range of activities lined up, including free health screenings, fitness classes and informational booths. Don't forget to visit our blood donation van located near the main entrance. Together, let's promote a healthier lifestyle. What event is being promoted? A. A free fitness class. B. A blood drive. C. Annual Community Health Fair. The correct answer is B. Annual Community Health Fair. Number 11. We'd like to remind all residents to attend the upcoming Neighborhood Safety Meeting this Thursday at 7 p.m. We'll discuss recent incidents and precautions to keep our community safe. Your participation is crucial. 
Thank you for being a proactive member of our community. When is the neighborhood safety meeting? A. Next Monday at 6 p.m. B. This Thursday at 7 p.m. C. This Friday at 7 p.m. The correct answer is A. This Thursday at 7 p.m. Number 12. Hello, and welcome to the cooking class. Today we'll be making an Italian classic, lasagna. Please follow the step-by-step -step instructions and don't hesitate to ask questions if you need help. At the end, we'll taste and enjoy our creations together. What is today's recipe? A. Lasagna. B. Pizza. C. Pasta. The correct answer is B. Lasagna. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along, and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one, he. In the company for five years now. A. Has worked. B. Works. C. Is working. D. Worked. The correct answer is A. Has worked. Number two, the report. Finished by the time they arrive tomorrow. A. Was. B. Will be. C. Will have been. D. Has been. The correct answer is C. Will have been. Number three. The company has expanded its operations. It, it, 20. 10. A. On. B. 4. C. Since. D. In. The correct answer is C. Since. Number four. I have completed the assignment. A. Any more. B. Already. C. Yet. D. Still. The correct answer is B. Already. Number five. We will meet. 10 like a.m. tomorrow. A. At, B, in, C, on, D, by. The correct answer is A, at. Number six, he is responsible. Overseeing the project. A, for, B, on, C, with, D, to. The correct answer is A. 4. Number 7. The project was completed. The budget was exceeded. A. Even though. B. Because. C. Although. D. So. The correct answer is A. Even though. Number 8. She denied the meeting. A. Attending. B. Attend. C. Attended. D. To attend. The correct answer is A. Attending. Number 9. The new software is at expensive than the old version. A. Most. B. To. C. So. D. More. The correct answer is D. More. Number 10. He apologized. The inconvenience caused. A. To. B. With. C. For. D. About. The correct answer is C. For. Number 11. The documents need to be sent. Tomorrow morning. A. In. 
b by c at d on the correct answer is b by Number 12. The company is known. Its innovative products. A. 2. B. By. C. With. D. 4. The correct answer is D. 4. Next up is Part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. Attention team, the security training session will be on Tuesday at 10 a.m. in the main hall. Please mark your calendars. Best, security office. A, conducted. B, conducts. C, conduct. D, conducting. The correct answer is A, conducted. Number two, hello team. The deadline for the quarterly report has been to next Friday. Please ensure your sections are finalized by then. Best regards, department head. A. Extending. B. Extends. C. Extension. D. Extended. The correct answer is D. Extended. Number 3. Customers. We are excited to announce that our new product line will be next month. Stay tuned for more updates on our website. Best marketing team. A. Launched. B. Launch. C. Launching. D. Launches. The correct answer is A. Launched. Number four. To all staff, please ensure that the maintenance checklist is completed. The end of each working day. Regards, Operations Manager. A. Within. B. At. C. Before. D. By. The correct answer is D. By. Number 5. Please ensure that all employees receive the new policy update. It is important that everyone. The new guidelines. A. Understanding. B. Understand. C. Understands. D. Understood. The correct answer is C. Understands. Number 6. Team, the quarterly report presentation will be held in the main conference room. Please be seated by 9 a.m. Thank you, admin team. A. Tomorrow. B. Yesterday. C. Last. D. Next. The correct answer is A. Tomorrow. And finally, Part 7. Reading. Reading Comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Dear Partners, We are thrilled to announce our annual conference, which will take place on October 10th, at the Grand Hotel. This year's theme is Innovation and Growth. We anticipate a day filled with insightful presentations and networking opportunities. Sincerely, the Organizing Committee. What is the theme of this year's conference? A. Innovation and Growth. B. Technology Advancements. C. Market Trends. The correct answer is A. Innovation and Growth. Number 2. Attention employees. Due to upcoming maintenance work, the company parking lot will be closed from Friday, April 10th to Sunday, April 12th. Alternative parking arrangements have been made at Lot B, a five-minute walk from the office. We appreciate your understanding and cooperation during this time. Why is the parking lot closed? A. For expansion. B. For maintenance work. C. For repaving. The correct answer is B. For maintenance work. Number 3. Dear Patrons, Our library will undergo renovation starting Monday, November 20th and will remain closed until further notice. 
We apologize for any inconvenience caused and look forward to welcoming you back to an improved facility. Regards, Library Management. What is the announcement about? A. Extended library hours. B. New library books. C. Library renovation. The correct answer is C. Library renovation. Number 4. To all employees, please be informed that the office will be closed on Friday, December 24th and will reopen on Monday, December 27th. This closure is in observance of the holiday season. We wish you all a happy and safe holiday. When will the office reopen? A. Friday, December 24th. B. Saturday, December 25th. C. Monday, December 27th. The correct answer is C. Monday, December 27th. Number 5. Hello, everyone. We are introducing a new remote work policy, effective immediately. Employees may now work from home up to three days a week, subject to manager approval. Detailed guidelines will be shared soon. Thank you, the management. What is the key update in the email? A. Introduction of a remote work policy. B. Launch of a mentoring program. C. Change in office location. The correct answer is A. Introduction of a remote work policy. Number 6. Attention. Due to maintenance work, the office elevators will be out of service from 8 p.m. to 6 a.m. for the next two days. We apologize for the inconvenience and appreciate your understanding. Facility Management Why will the office elevators be out of service? A. For a thorough cleaning. B. Due to maintenance work. C. Because of an inspection. The correct answer is B. Due to maintenance work. Number 7. Hi everyone, don't forget that the team building workshop is scheduled for next Wednesday at 9 a.m. It will take place in the main hall. Participation is mandatory for all team members. See you there. Best, team coordinator. When is the team building workshop scheduled? A. Next Wednesday at 9 a.m. B. This Friday at 10 a.m. C. Next Monday at 2 p.m. The correct answer is A. This Thursday at 8 a.m. Number 8. Dear members, we are excited to inform you that the gym will be extending its hours starting next month. The new hours will be from 5 a.m. to 11 p.m., Monday through Sunday. We hope this extension allows for more flexibility in your workout schedule. Best, gym management. What change is being announced? A. New membership fees. B. Extended gym hours. C. New workout classes. The correct answer is B. Extended gym hours. Number 9. Our new product line, EcoClean, is now available. EcoClean offers a range of eco friendly cleaning products. Visit our website to learn more and place your order today. Enjoy a cleaner home and a cleaner planet with EcoClean. What is the purpose of the text? A. To promote EcoClean products. B. To provide cleaning tips. C. To announce a sale. The correct answer is A. To promote EcoClean products. Number 10. Dear Partners, we are pleased to inform you about the upcoming webinar on October 10th, covering the latest trends in digital marketing. Register now through our website to reserve your spot. We look forward to your participation. Best regards, marketing team. What is the webinar about? A. Financial planning. B. Employee training. C. Digital marketing trends. The correct answer is C. Digital Marketing Trends Number 11. Dear Valued Clients, we are relocating our office to a new and larger space to better serve you. The new address is 7 and 8 9 Maple Avenue, 
Effective from October 1st. We look forward to welcoming you to our new office. What is the purpose of this announcement? A. To introduce new staff. B. To announce a new service. C. To inform about office relocation. The correct answer is C. To inform about office relocation. Number 12. Attention employees. Due to maintenance work, the company's parking lot will be closed this weekend. Please make arrangements to use the adjacent lot or public transport if you need to visit the office. Thank you for your cooperation. Best. Facilities management. Why is the parking lot being closed? A. For a company event. B. To reduce costs. C. For maintenance work. The correct answer is C. For maintenance work. Number 13. Dear customers, we are excited to announce the grand opening of our new store in downtown Chicago. To celebrate, we are offering a 20% discount on all purchases made during the first week. Visit us at 123 Main Street, starting Monday, September 15th. We look forward to welcoming you. Sincerely, the management team. What is the purpose of this announcement? A. To announce a store closure. B. To inform about a new store opening. C. To offer a permanent discount. The correct answer is B. To inform about a new store opening. Number 14. Dear Patrons, Please note that our library will be closed for inventory checks from December 10th to December 12th. We appreciate your patience and apologize for any inconvenience. Thank you, library staff. Why will the library be closed? A. For renovations. B. For inventory checks. C. For staff training. The correct answer is B. For inventory checks. Number 15. Dear team, due to unforeseen circumstances, our scheduled meeting for this Friday has been postponed to next Tuesday at 10 a.m. Please adjust your calendars accordingly. Thank you for your flexibility. Best regards, HR Department. Why was this email sent? A. To confirm the meeting. B. To announce a change in meeting time. C. To cancel the meeting. The correct answer is B. To announce a change in meeting time. Number 16. Our customer service team is now available 24-7 to assist you with any inquiries you may have. Whether you need help with your account or have questions about our services, we are here to help at any time of day. What new feature is being promoted? A. 24-7 customer service availability. B. Account management upgrades. C. New service offerings. The correct answer is A. 24 7 customer service availability. Number 17. Dear patrons, we regret to inform you that our restaurant will be closed for renovation from July 10th to July 20th. We look forward to welcoming you back with an updated menu and a refreshed dining area. Thank you for your patronage. Best regards, the management. What is the main idea of this notice? A. Special dining offers. B. New menu introduction. C. Temporary restaurant closure for renovation. The correct answer is C. Temporary restaurant closure for renovation. Number 18. Dear students. The university has organized a series of workshops on career development and job searching skills. These sessions will run from November 1st to November 15th in the Career Services Center. All students are encouraged to participate and make the best use of this opportunity. For registration and details, visit the university website. Best regards, the Career Services Team. What is the announcement about? A. University sports events. B. Career Development Workshops. C. New Academic Courses. The correct answer is 
B. Career Development Workshops